So Cole got the candy cane. I put on the star because I had an extra, you know, if you lose a piece. But mm -hmm. I'm keeping mine together. And I have this one. I got presents. They don't open. told him how old you are, so that you get a gift. Look at this. Get this piece. Can you get this piece? Yeah. Okay. Me. I'm making the queen. There's a lot of tape. Colty. No, grab I this piece. Knife. You need this piece. I think. This piece. Bob, I can help you. No, I got it. You got it? Colty, come here. Here. Okay, grab this piece, and then you gotta grab a piece that looks like that. You see that piece? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That goes here, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Did you put it on? Yeah. And there. And then we need to find this little piece. Can Daddy do that? There. Oh, grab these pieces. Put them right there. No, no, these. No, on the front too. Right there. Okay. Yeah. We need two Grab yellows. Three. These two are thin, and this one's thin. You put the yellows there. So I got these lovely earrings from Jess today, a subscriber, and I just wanted to say thank you so much. Um, she sent this beautiful, just heartfelt card and it means so much to me. And they're little opal hearts and it just means so much to me. Thank you so, so much, Jess. Like, you made my day, girl. Thank you. Okay, so we are heading out to go and get some groceries. We're gonna hit up Costco. Shane has to go to the bank. I so don't know where I'm looking at on this camera. Um, I switched into this sweater and I have like a white t-shirt on and then some jeans. This sweater is so awesome. It is so soft and it's like my favorite thing that I've bought. It cost about $25 and it was from a store called Giant Tiger. So if you're in Canada and you want a really great sweater, totally recommend this thing. Um, I've got my new earrings on. They're so sweet. And I had just have this like Milani lip gloss on. It's a lot darker in person. Um, but I like having a little pop of bright color on my lips, I think. Um, I actually used to wear lipstick that was kind of dark like this all the time. It was just part of my look way back in the day, like kind of just after college, which was like 18 years ago. Um, yeah. So anyways, we are going to head off and do some shopping. It's a little after four. <sighs> Hopefully the stores aren't a zoo. Okay, so one thing that I do before I go out, especially like doing Costco and all of these big shopping things, I'm not one who likes to do running to multiple stores. I would just rather be home. 
I put on some Motivate. This is a blend from doTERRA, and I put it in my own roller bottle just with some fractionated coconut oil. I roll it on the wrist, my wrists and the back of my neck, and it really does make a difference. So, Motivate. Yeah. So Aubrey's wearing my hat and my scarf, and Colt's wearing his dad's hat. Oh, guys, you guys are funny. <laughs> okay, I will. Guess who's looking for buses, too? Who? This guy. Oh, no. <laughs> look for, look for a bus. Okay. Look for a bus. Here, come again. No pictures or selfies. <laughs> <laughs> No pictures, no selfies or videos. <laughs> and what were you doing? Did you find a good deal? A what? A good deal. Yes. Well, hey friends, I'm sitting here editing the vlog and I realized that the next couple of clips are not going to make much sense. So I'm jumping in here to kind of explain what we're doing. So when we were out and about, Aubrey suggested a game that we should play. And so we were playing it and Cole came up with an idea for a game. And his game was is that we needed to see how many buses we could find and it would be like a competition um, and if you saw a bus you were to yell out bus and we would keep track of who found the most buses we were trying to get to 10. Colt and I teamed up to be on a team um, and Shane and Aubrey were on a team and so we played this like our whole shopping trip and it was so fun and it's been days later and every time we get in the truck to go anywhere we end up like doing this bus game and it is so competitive and so fun because it's not just city buses it's like school buses it's like anything anywhere any bus and it is I don't know it's exciting and fun. So anyways, the next couple of clips are of us playing the bus game. There's one point where I get really excited and shout bus. So just FYI, if you're listening on headphones or something of that nature. Are you, you're videotaping the last bus? You think it's gonna be here? It's gonna be somewhere close. Yeah. We all can feel it. <laughs> this is more exciting than running dogs. <laughs> this is like better than the national championship. <laughs> like we've been playing this game for half an hour, like two hours. No by one. This is the game that never ends. No by one. That was a sweet. No, no by no, no by. Okay, fella. No by Boss! No! Yes! <laughs> Playing, Colty. No, by one. No. Yes, we did. No. You said ten, and we already got eleven. So we beat you two times miles. We got one more eleven times. I'm a surprise. <laughs> Colty's gonna call a bus, and then he's gonna say the game's over, and he won. <laughs> Nailed two. Right, right, where? 